This is a message hologram effect. You all need two clips. First one is your phone laying down and a screen record of your messages. If you want, you can download my clips from the description. Drag your clips on the timeline and then within the messages clip, go to the Fusion page. In the Fusion page, click Shift Space and add Delta Keyer. With Delta Keyer, you want to use this tool to remove all the background from this specific area. Now, when you have a clip without any background, you will want to cut to make the messages a bit shorter so that they don't stay too long on the screen. So I'm going to add the cut here and then another cut right before the next message appears. Like this. And to make the second message shorter, I'm going to add another cut and another one before it goes away. And it should look something like this. Now create a new compound clip. And just simply using the transform and cropping, adjust the values until the message is clean and big on the screen. So we'll want to crop from the top a bit. And of course from the bottom. Like this. Then from the right. And from the left too. Oh, sorry, this is a top one. Left is right here. We can make it even bigger, just like this. Now you can just go ahead and put the messages on top of your phone clip. And we should have something that looks just like this. Now we'll want to adjust the messages a little bit so it appears that it's right above the phone. So I'm going to adjust these values right here. And I'm going to rotate it a little bit too. Maybe rotation is not the best idea. So instead we're going to do something else. So create a fusion clip and go to the fusion page. Now in the fusion page, click shift space and add a node called DVE. Using DVE, we're going to make our message look a bit more like a hologram. So just adjust the X, I and Z values. So let's see, for X, we can move the message so it's looking a bit up. And for the I, we can turn it a bit to the right side. And using Z, we can make it do that turn that I spoke about before. Like this. There we go. It looks already so much better. Now we can adjust so it's a bit closer to the phone. So let's bring it down a little bit. And a little bit to the right side. There we go. That's pretty cool. Okay, so now I'd say this hologram looks a bit flat. It doesn't seem real like it's 3D, more like 2D, just turned and rotated. So go to the Fusion page and after DVE, add another node called Shadow. And what you want to do here is bring the softness all the way up. It's just going to add a shadow right behind the message text. And it looks much better already. Like this is before and this is after. And the last thing you want to do is go to the Fusion page and after Shadow node, add another node called Soft Glow. Now just adjust the gain so the hologram is shining a little bit. I think this is pretty good. And as you can see, it looks just awesome. Nice. Now the last thing you'll want to do is add some sound effects so your clip comes to life because there's a very big difference between this and this. Sound effects are the most important part of any kind of video. If you like this, please leave a like, subscribe and check out more of my amazing tutorials right here.